Hi, I'm John Ward, president of Boston Whaler. I'm here at the Miami International Boat Show to welcome you aboard the new Boston Whaler 345 Conquest. What is the production timeline for the 345? The 345 Conquest will go into production for the 2008 model year beginning in July of this year. When will it be available to the consumer? Well, we'll start shipping boats in the third quarter, so dealers will start to see product at our dealerships worldwide beginning in the third quarter. The 345 Conquest is special for many reasons. First and foremost, it's a Boston Whaler, and it's built with our Unibond construction process. In addition to that, the 345 Conquest has some other unique features and attributes. First, the integrated hardtop windshield system that you see here is new and innovative for not just Boston Whaler, but for boats in this size and, and class. Where can I find more information on the 345? Well, we have a brochure that's available here at the boat show, or you can go to our website, www.whaler.com. Hi, I'm Ron Berman, Vice President of Product Development and Engineering, here to show you the 345 Conquest. Ron, describe the competitive advantages of the 345 Conquest. Well, the 345 combines great fishing features with wonderful cabin amenities to provide a very comfortable fishing boat that our consumers will be asking for. What are some of the features or innovations that really stand out on the 345? There are many innovations and notable features on the 345. Uh, probably most notable is how feature-rich the boat is, and that begins with the innovative hardtop uh, helm deck enclosure system. The 345 is a great performer, and great performance begins with the power plant. Uh, we're fortunate to be able to rig our boats exclusively with Mercury Verado power. The boat we're on today is equipped with triple 250 horsepower Verado engines. They're driven with a uh, DTS control system, drive-by-wire, and they feature power hydraulic assist steering, making the boating experience truly pleasurable. And the other thing that's great is with this power option, we've got a boat as large and big as this is, that runs in excess of 50 miles an hour. That's great performance. As we see here, this boat's equipped with triple engines, but we have a lot of customers that are not as concerned with speed, so we also offer the 345 with a twin engine Verado standard. With that product, you get a boat that runs in the low 40s, gets on plane great, and handles wonderfully well. The swim platform area of the 345 has some great features as well. Beginning with the molded in step we have right here, this makes boarding from a dock much, much easier without stepping around the side of the boat. Additionally, we've engineered the swim ladder to be totally concealed. Below this lid is a nice stainless steel ladder that if you are in the water, you can grab this clip right here, undo it, and the ladder will slide straight out and deploy in the water. Whaler stands for safety, and we've engineered a ladder system that supports that uh, core value of Boston Whaler. The other aspect of our transom design is the overall use of space. Because of the advanced geometry of the Verado midsection, we've been able to reduce the amount of space between the transom and the interior of the cockpit and gain very valuable cockpit space. That's a true usable benefit to our customers. Step aboard the cockpit of 345 and you enter a 58 square foot space that provides great features for fishing as well as cruising activities. The customers of the 345 Conquest will enjoy the great features we've baked into this boat, beginning with the port and starboard cockpit entertainment or bait prep centers. This particular boat is equipped with our optional electric grill for creating meals and dining al fresco. Although this boat's equipped with our optional electric grill, if the customer chooses not to get this grill, what they'll get is a nice tray area here compartmentalized with a cutting board above it, a great place for prepping baits or cutting limes for drinks if you want. It also features a nice sink, and on the starboard side is a refrigerator freezer, a top load unit. It's very deep and will contain all the supplies you need for a day of entertaining, or is a great place to freeze bait for your fishing adventures. The next standout feature of the cockpit of the 345 is all the great seating available. Beginning with the pull-out cooler that doubles as a seat. This unit slides out, it's a nice fiberglass cooler, it's got a cushion on top, it's a great place to sit and watch baits if you're fishing, but when you don't want it out, it conveniently slides away and stores neatly out of the way. The next thing we offer is a nice full width aft fold away stern seat. This seat is easily deployed and creates a 
creates a very comfortable area for three people. And as I mentioned earlier, we spent a lot of time listening to our customers. And one thing they told us was that they wanted a very, very comfortable aft seat. And one part of that is making a comfortable backrest. So we've designed this backrest so when you're sitting here, it's nice and high, provides good back support, and it's a great place to sit and ride or just hang out at the dock and enjoy the day. Fishability is one of the 345 strong suits, and that begins with an abundant number of rod holders. This boat features four gunnel rod holders, three more rod holders across the transom, and six rod holders on either of the hardtop legs. Additionally, for the fishermen, we've included two large in-floor fish boxes. Because of Unibond construction, we have a very, very well insulated fish box that will hold the catch of the day, store amenities, uh, and, and keep it very cold. Our foam construction creates at least a three inch thick foam section around the fish box. Cockpit features for the fishermen also include stainless steel tow rails for safety and security while fishing, downrigger weight holders, 12 volt cockpit outlets, and a large live well in the back corner of the boat. It's very deep, nice rounded corners, and should keep the bait for the day alive quite well. And like all whalers, all deck hatches feature a two-sided molded hatch with a very, very durable, low-maintenance gel coat finish on the backside. They're all gasketed sealed for a quiet ride and to retain the contents quite well. Through our Voice of the Customer activities, we learn that our customers desire a equipment space that's very easy to access and easy to service. Through our Voice of the Customer work, we talked to 305 Conquest owners who really liked the way we designed the bilge access to that product. So we built upon that idea and created a bilge space that is both service accessible and provides some great additional features. Below these four hatch dogs lies a great equipment space supported by two gas struts. The, the hatch itself opens very easily. It's supported very well. And again, it features a gasketed gutter system uh, to keep the bilge nice and dry. You'll notice there's a nice molded fiberglass part here. And this not only provides a cover over the fuel tank, but provides some additional storage under the lid. It's a great place for things such as dock lines. You'll also note that the entire bilge is molded gel coat fiberglass for low maintenance and a great appearance. The 345 Conquest is equipped with an 8KW Fisher Panda diesel generator. The output of this unit will provide more than enough power to drive all the appliances on board this vessel. When you're done servicing or accessing, accessing your bilge components, it's a simple matter of closing the lid. It closes very nice and slow, very easily, no slamming. Close the four latches and you've got a nice, very sealed up bilge compartment. One of the most impressive parts of the 345 is our innovative hardtop windshield system. This area provides fantastic weather protection for the occupants of the boat. It also provides many comfort features to make everybody happy. The hardtop is not the only notable feature of this boat. The helm area, the seating areas, as well as the great layout that's easy to move through sets this boat apart. The helm area of the 345 is truly impressive. One of the things our customers told us and that we noticed through our voice work is that people are installing larger and larger electronics on their boats these days. So we designed the helm area, the 345, to house today's largest electronics. This boat is equipped with our optional North Star 8000i dual screen electronics package. This innovative piece of electronics not only performs all navigation functions, but it also provides a great way to play your MP3s and videos right on your electronics. They're equipped with a USB port to be able to upload your favorite songs and then control them through the display. It's networked into the JL custom audio system on board as well, so you can control your audio system right on your electronics display. Features of the helm include Mercury DTS throttle and shift controls, and this boat, which is triple engine, features what's called shadow mode. You can operate three engines with two control handles. There's many, many great features baked into this system that will surely allow any user to enjoy their product even more. This boat also features Mercury's new vessel view display, 
This is the engine monitoring system that shows the operator all the engine functions as well as boat system functions such as fuel and water tank levels. Moving over to the helm, this boat comes with our custom whaler cast stainless steel wheel, custom instrument panel with backlit switches, and the whole package is housed in a nice dark gel coat color with a texture on top for reduced glare while operating in bright and sunny conditions. Moving over to the port end of the dash, you'll also notice that there's a small storage compartment or glove box. Our customers said they desired a place to put small items on their dash, so we've created this nice compartment. It features a 12 volt outlet inside, so if you want to keep your cell phone charged, it's a great place to put it, close the door, and it's securely, securely stored. Additionally, there's an MP3 jack. You can plug your iPod or MP3 player in here to play your tunes through the audio system as well as two cup holders. To make cruising and fishing more comfortable, we've equipped the cockpit of the 345 Conquest with the 18,000 BTU air conditioning heat system. It features vents for the occupants of the cockpit, as well as vents up here on the dash to keep the captain very comfortable while underway. Customers told us they desired a premium audio system on a boat of this type. So we went out and researched and found JL Audio Components and have equipped the 345 with these. These speakers have great sound, and the way we've installed them strategically places them to provide great sound balance throughout the helm area and the aft cockpit. To keep our customers comfortable, we provide great seating in the helm area of the 345 Conquest. We've got seating for three to face forward and great lounging space. We've added a starboard helm chair for a passenger, and this seat features styling typical door helm seat, a nice flip up thigh rise, and for added comfort on long cruises, this seat actually slides inboard to create a, a wider seat area. We provide a cup holder on this side, but when the seat's pushed over, we also provide a cup holder on the inboard side to make sure the passenger always has a place to put their beverage. Moving to the deluxe helm chair, this features our whaler design custom helm chair. It's deeply padded, has a flip up thigh rise, it's mounted on very heavy duty hardware, and features a vertical rise adjustment. Now moving over to the port lounge, again as I mentioned earlier, it provides a great place for someone to sit riding forward as well as wonderful lounging room for two to three people. Underneath this seat is a nice storage area as well. By lifting this cushion and opening the lid, you can access a very deep self-draining compartment. Another convenience feature of the 345 is how we've laid out and how accessible our electrical system is. Beginning with our main DC breaker panel and battery switch panel, it's mounted high, very easy to reach without having to bend over to access the switches. Directly below this compartment is where we've located the batteries, making them very easy to access for serviceability. By simply opening these two doors, you've got clear, easy access to inspect your batteries and to ensure great serviceability to the battery system. Moving from the cockpit down into the cabin of the 345 is very easy. By simply opening the top hatch of the sliding cabin door, opening the bifold and securing it open against the magnetic stop, it's very easy to walk down in the cabin of the 345. In the cabin of the 345, you'll find a world of comfort and luxury. The exterior of the cockpit is set up for great cruising and fishing but coming down inside, our customers wanted a very comfortable place to go, get out of the weather, enjoy, relax, prepare a meal, or spend the night. As you can see, the 345 features a very open layout. Most notable in the forward end is our island bed. This feature is unique in the outboard powered product class that the 345 will compete in. It features a nice six inch thick mattress, very deluxe bedding and bedspread, and one neat feature that our customers will sure enjoy, it's got a powered headrest on the bed. By the touch of a button, the front of the bed raises up and creates a nice headrest for watching TV, which includes the 20-inch flat screen TV on the aft bulkhead of the cabin. In creating the interior environment of the 345, we enlisted the help of an interior designer to come up with the color scheme to create this rich and inviting interior. It features rich materials like Caradon solid surface countertops, designer fabrics, 
hardwood genuine flooring designer details in the ceiling and a wonderful lighting system that includes dimmers on all lights to create the ambience and mood that any customer would want. Through our research, we found that our customers like to cook at their galleys. So we provided them with a very large galley that will provide wonderful space for preparing meals, setting things out, or just general area to arrange things. It features a very deep, large sink, large enough for washing plates in, a dual burner flush cooktop with touch controls, a very large open counter surface for preparing meals, a combination microwave coffee maker, plenty of storage, nice natural and supplemental lighting behind this decorative panel, plenty of drawer storage down below, and a nice large refrigerator for keeping your food nice and fresh. Moving on to the starboard side of the cabin, we find a, a large hanging locker with light inside. It's suitable for storing personal belongings as well as hanging up clothes inside. It's built out of a nice wood grain finish, solid wood corner posts, and it sets the forward end of our rod storage area. In these racks, you can store far, four large offshore fishing reels. It's a great place to showcase your prize tackle and they're stored in an out-of-the-way place that won't inhibit you from using the entire interior. Moving down from there you'll find a nice spacious long settee here. It creates a great place for lounging, having meals, and when you want to dine we've added a genuine hardwood table in the center of the cockpit mounted on a heavy-duty gas rise table base. To convert this area into a bed it's a simple matter of pushing down the table, deploying the cushion, and you now have a bed for another guest. As I mentioned earlier, the 345 is very spacious and open. The main salon features six foot eight inch headroom and a very, very open plan to the mid-sleeper. Our engineers have designed this product to keep the entire front of the mid-sleeper wide open. It creates a more spacious appearance and it creates a very nice area for lounging back in the mid-sleeper. You'll notice we've designed this so it can be used in a seating position such as we have it here and by removing the aft bolsters across the back and laying them in the center right here, you can create a nice double berth for your guests to spend the night on. Adding to the spacious feel of the cabin is the open pedestal step design we used. The steps are teak tread for sure-footedness and they flow inboard to the center of the cabin to create a very easy path to get in the boat and exit, but also keep a nice open airy feeling for the mid-sleeper. The head compartment of the 345 is quite roomy and large. By opening this wood grain door, it reveals a nice open space for our customers. On the back of the door is a full length mirror, and stepping inside, our customers will find a head compartment with six foot two inch headroom, plenty of storage space, a vacuum flush head that is connected to an 18 gallon holding tank, a nice deluxe shower system that stores neatly in the bulkhead. This area also features a nice vanity area with a nice deep sink, the Caradon solid surface countertop, and plenty of storage below. Ventilation is provided through a power vent, and there's also an air conditioning vent inside the head compartment. You'll also notice that we've included standard fittings to hold things such as shampoo, toothbrushes, and soap in the cabin these are things that you would typically have to add to another boat after you purchase it. The forward berth of the 345 also boasts some great storage. Underneath the mattress you'll find a very large storage tub. This tub is removable to provide access to the bow thruster and batteries. And by the way, the bow thruster is standard. Also below the bunk are two nice large storage drawers to provide personal items our customers will bring on board their boat. As noted earlier, the 345 Conquest comes equipped with a standard Lumar bow thruster. In designing the 345, we wanted to provide a platform with great performance. And great performance is more than just how fast the boat goes. Great performance also includes dry ride, great plane ability, and great handling. So our in-house naval architect designed the hull of the 345 to do just that. Beginning with the nice sharp entry, 
dual full length lifting strakes and a nice high wide chine typical to all whalers we not only provide a boat that will cut through a head sea incredibly well but also keep the occupants and the top sides of the boat incredibly dry well i hope you've enjoyed our tour of the great features and benefits of the 345 conquest i think you'll agree that we've created a vessel that combines great fishability with great cruising and comfort features to provide a product truly unique in the marketplace